I'm here with Dennis Crowley, co-founder and CEO of Foursquare. Can you explain me what uh, Foursquare as a location-based services offers? Yeah, sure. So we're building things for cell phones that allow uh, people to check into different places. And really, checking in is just, you know, sharing your experiences with people. Saying, I'm here, or I've been here, or is this a place that I want to go to? And, you know, the, the whole idea of Foursquare is it's supposed to make it easier for, um, you know, for people to learn about their cities and explore their neighborhoods and just connect with the people nearby. Can I only do this with smartphones or with any mobile phone? Yeah, you can really do it with any mobile phone. It works best on smartphones. So, like, we haven't, like, at Foursquare, we make an app for, uh, for iPhone and for Android and for Black and then you know through our API we've had other developers go out and build them for uh, for Nokia and for Windows Mobile and for Palm and uh, really you can use it on any phone you have. And besides the social aspects, uh, what are the main reasons for people who use it um, to participate in that? Um, well, I mean, I think the social reasons are one of the, the main reasons, but I mean, I use it a lot just to track the places that I've been to. So, like, here I'm, I'm in Paris, I live in New York, I checked into my hotel so I can remember it next time, I checked into the coffee shop I went to and a couple of the places we went to last night, just so I know where I was. And so next time I come back here, I can, you know, be like, oh, this was the neighborhood, this was the place that I remember, this is the place I want to go back to. And I do that here, I do that in New York, so. Yeah, I work also on branding and advertising. How can brands benefit from that? Sure. So we started um, we started building tools for uh, for brands as well as media companies to really uh, leave content all over the the world. And so if you think about it, you know, there's really like you know th these a lot of these these folks can just come up with city guide style content about you know what should I do when I'm in Paris? What should I do when I'm in New York? Where are the best places to eat? What's the, what are the best experiences to have? And the only way to un unlock that content is to really go out and explore the world. And as you check into places, these messages will pop up like, oh, while you're in this part of Paris, you should definitely check out this art yeah. gallery. Oh, while you're here you should do this. Can you give me one example of uh, how our brand was very successful on your side? Oh, so we've done some stuff with the New York Times with mm -hmm. a lot of their travel information. We've done some stuff which is for pretty easy to, to think about how that would work. We've done some stuff with um, uh, TV channels in the US where they basically take content about their shows and stash it around so you, you learn about like, oh, this is where this episode of this reality TV showed up. We did some things with the History Channel where nuggets of history appear wherever you check in. So, you know, if you check in near our office, you, uh, you get a tip about Oh, this is where uh, the, the very first elevator ever made was here. You know, it's just like weird ways for people to use the platform. Yeah. These are all very huge uh, companies and also in media sector. Uh, um, how can a normal brand, like a medium-sized brand, yeah. which offers not only services but maybe real products, what okay. could they do? What would you suggest them? Yeah, it's it's really like, you know, you think about Foursquare is supposed to help make the real world easier for people to discover. So if a brand has a message that they want to get across, like let's say you're like a, uh, you know, like a, a diapers brand, and this example comes up all the time. Like you wouldn't want to. Like it's hard to think about how you could use Foursquare unless you'd be like, oh well, maybe we make a channel about making it easier for new parents to rediscover their neighborhoods. You know, or if it's um, you know a sporting brand, you can say, oh well, these are the best places to exercise, or this is you know these are different ways that you can do, or different ways to like look at your city. So it requires some creative you know thinking on the parts of the brands and the agencies. But uh, you know we're starting to get to that point where people are figuring out how to do it. And um, if I check in in a place, for example, uh, in Berlin, I've checked in in a Starbucks place yeah. and I found out that other people that checked in uh, many, many, many times, uh, sure, they sure. got a voucher. Yeah, yeah. What are the most successful, um, how do you say, uh, case studies? Yeah, so I mean, really one of the things that we're most excited about with Foursquare is the ability to help local merchants bring new customers in and reward loyal customers. Um, and so we have the system and if you have a local, mer I mean, if you are a business, local business, you can just go to Foursquare and claim your business. It's foursquare.com slash businesses. And from there, you can go and say, well, I want to reward people that have been here once, or I want to reward people that have been here five times, or I want to reward people that come in with their friends, or come in with their friends often. And they can set up little specials. Like, they, you know, they define the rules. And, um, you know, we, we have tens of thousands of merchants, like, really all around the world that are offering these types of specials to people. And for you as a business, what is the business model behind it? Um, well, right now, like, we're still pretty early for us to figure that out. Like, we have a good idea of how it's going to work out. Like, I'm really, um, I feel very strongly about the tools that we're building for local merchants, like, in order to give them some insight into who the best customers are and to be able to surface um, deals and coupons and special offers. Yeah, like, who do you charge? Do you charge the end user or brands that well, are using your tools? the end user. Um, right now, we've started charging some brands for some of the things we've done on Foursquare. It's really just a lot of experimentation. Um, we're not charging the local merchants yet, but I think that's going to be a big opportunity for us in the future. Like, as we can build 
build tools that really help them drive new customers into the door. Yeah, the other num uh, number one global player, I think, in that field. How come? Were you? Did you have a first mover advantage, or did you just how, like what are your key success factors? Um, well, I think we've been, you know, we we've, we've been doing this for a long time. Like I had a startup before this that was, um, you know, thinking about similar problems, and I've worked at other companies that were thinking about certain problems. So, you know, we've been thinking about this stuff for almost 10 years, and we've assembled a very amazing team in New York that's just really good at building these things and thinking through a lot of the issues. And I think that's the that's the thing that makes our company kind of special is that. We've got this group of people that's really dedicated to building this stuff out and really passionate about the product. And what, uh, tell us a secret, what will be the next uh, feature or in which direction could it be? Uh, well, we try not to pre-announce Like things. a big step or what would you dream to do? Like Oh, well, I mean, the thing that we really dream to do is like, you know, th the next time I come back to Paris, I want my phone to be able to tell me like, oh, how many days are you here? Oh, you've been here, for, you're going to be here for three days. These are the 10 things that you need to do while you're here. You know, and I want the phone to push me to do things. Like, I've been at this conference and just kind of hanging out for a couple of days, but I want it to tell me to like, go try this restaurant, go see this art gallery, go meet this person. And, you know, I feel strongly that we can build things that really, that can do those. And I think people are going to really enjoy that stuff. I'm definitely going to follow this. Thank you very much. Right, thanks so much.